So, your first Facebook Ads campaign. As I said in previous video, the main point in the first stage is to get a quick result, as fast as possible. Your first ad campaign is not going to be effective. It's not going to be even a real campaign when you're promoting a real business. You can create text and pictures by yourself, but we strongly recommend to use our template and just run it. You won't learn all the features, maybe you won't even understand what happened. But the main thing is that you run it by yourself. It will work and it will give you the first potential clients, I mean leads. It's like learning to drive a car. In the first lesson, the main thing is to start from a place and drive first 20 meters. In the case of Facebook ads, it is to set up a primitive campaign and get the first leads. Remember the four main legs of Facebook advertising that I talked about earlier? We'll start with products and services. We decided to take a niche that all people can understand. That's the dentistry. Imagine that the owner of a small dentistry comes to you and wants to run ads for his business. To do this, you need to answer the following questions. What are we advertising? What is the goal of the advertising campaign? Why do people use this service? How is our dental service differs from others? I made a little spreadsheet where I answered these simple questions. We specifically chose the example of dentistry, which is clear to all. But trust me, you will have clients who come to you with niches that are not immediately clear, and your task will be to understand their business in more detail. You have to do deep interviews with clients to do that. It's not that easy, and we'll talk about this in the next part of the course. Now I want to draw your attention to the fact that dentistry has several products. These are dental checkups, dental treatments, braces, braces cleaning, tooth extraction, and so on. Under all these products, you can create different advertising campaign for different audiences. We choose to take the teeth cleaning and checkup service. Now, more about the goals of the ad campaign. In our case, is to attract more clients to the clinic. The goal of advertising campaigns may be different. For example, McDonald's has brand awareness. This is completely different advertising type, which needs different tools. We'll talk about it in the next video too. One of the most critical question is what makes our product or service different from others? Why should people buy from us rather than from a competitor? Do we have a better price or are we better in what we do? Or do we perform a dental cleaning on special equipment that our competitors don't have? Or does the doctor who does it have 20 years of experience? Now you don't need to answer this question in detail. Now, the main thing is to start thinking in these categories. Over time, you will have the marketer's mindset. You will look at the world and products differently. You will pay attention to the ads of other marketers. You will begin to think, how would I promote this product? So, let's move on. Now, our task is to understand what audience we are going to promote dental checkup services to. I think it will be people aged from 20 to 35, men and women who are interested in dental care. It's important to specify the country and even city where you're promoting, or you'll be advertising all over the world. Dentistry is a local business and no one will go to another country to check their braces. Now I took the country of Pakistan as an example, because testing ads in that region will be much cheaper than in US and Europe. Now we have an example of the simplest audience, because dentistry is a mass product. But if you promote travel cases for businessmen, then your audience is people who are engaged in business and often travel. Now let's move on to advertising information, or creatives. We move on to the third part of setting up an advertising campaign. We need to write our offer, which will interest potential customers. Facebook Ads has two main components. They are text format and visual format. The visual format can be static, that is a picture, and dynamic, this is a video. These two formats or information work together. People are different, someone likes to watch, someone likes to read. So you need to write a text in a couple of lines and create a picture. That will make the person do the action you need. In our case, it's to complete a form with contact information, so we can call that leads and get them into our dental clinic. On the slide, you can see the text and the picture that we will use for the future advertising. 
You can find the text and the picture below this video. So, we understood the product and the service that we sell. We understood the audience for which we will show the ad and we wrote the text and the picture of the ad. The next step is to set up an advertising campaign on Facebook Business Manager. It will be in the next video.